What's poppin' people? Allegonian here. Today I'm gonna be talking about whether or not it's worth it to get Adobe Creative Cloud Suite. So I've been using Adobe products for over 10 years. I used to crack them on the Pirate Bay, but I found that was really time consuming. Sometimes I get viruses. One time I got this virus called ransomware where they locked all the files on my computer and you had to pay like $1,000 to get them back. I ended up losing all my files. And of course it just took hours and hours um, but I couldn't afford, you know, pay $600 to $1,000 per program because I use Lightroom, Photoshop, After Effects, Premiere Pro. So I was really excited when Creative Cloud came out and I've actually been a subscriber almost since the very beginning. So one of the main advantages to Creative Cloud is how affordable it is. So if you're just looking for a Photoshop in Lightroom, that's just going to run you $10 a month, which is pretty awesome. If you want to get all the programs, that's going to be $53 a month which is still honestly so affordable considering all the programs that you get. And if you're a student or a teacher at a university, then you can get all the programs for only $20 a month, which is pretty awesome. That's what I pay. So one of the main advantages to having Creative Cloud over buying the software is that you get constant updates. So they release a new version of almost every one of their programs every single year, and they're constantly updating it throughout the year. And so often I'll just open up Premiere Pro and be like, oh wow, there's these cool new features. And that's just included with the subscription. Another really helpful thing is that you can cancel at any time. So if you're going through financial hardship or if you just want to try out the software to see if you like it, then really you only have to invest one month's worth of subscription fee and then you can just cancel it and you don't have to cough off a bunch of money up front. Now lastly, I do want to mention free alternatives. So if you are struggling with money or you're just getting started, then it might not be necessary for you to get the Creative Cloud. If you're a professional artist or looking to get more professional and get more in depth in your craft, I definitely recommend the Creative Cloud, especially Premiere Pro, After Effects, Photoshop, and Lightroom I found to be the absolute best programs for photo and video editing. But if you're just looking to start a YouTube channel or just edit a few photos that you got, there are free alternatives. In my experience, they're harder to use and not quite as good, but they can probably get the job done. So overall, do I recommend Adobe Creative Cloud? Absolutely, two thumbs up. If you are a creative professional or looking to take your craft more seriously, or even if you're just looking to mess around and have some fun in these programs, it's so worth it because of just how affordable the price is for what you're getting. So if you enjoyed this video and you're looking more into the Creative Cloud, I put my referral link down in the description. I will get a little bit of the first month or year that you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know if you have any questions at all in the comment section below, and I hope you have an amazing day. Peace.